Hello, grade 10 students. So today, we're going to talk about the digestive system. We will make an introduction about the digestive system, but make sure that uh, you know everything about the food test. Okay? So you have to make a table about the food test, the different food tests, and to write them on your copybook. So the digestive system in the human body. So what you see now is the digestive system in the human body. The digestive system is made up of two main parts, two big parts. What we call the digestive tube. And what do we mean by the digestive tube? We mean the organs where food passes. So the organs where food passes, all these organs are uh, called the digestive tube. So what are these different organs? First of all, we have the mouth. Okay, so the food first passes in the mouth and then the esophagus. Then the stomach, after the stomach, the food will pass into the small intestine, in the large intestine, and pay attention, only the undigested food will keep moving to the large intestine, and finally the anus. Okay? So, the digestive tube is made up of organs <coughs> where food passes. Yalihinne, mouth, esophagus, stomach, small intestine, large intestine, and anus. However, the second part is called the digestive glands. What do we mean by glands? The glands are organs that help in digestion, that will secrete certain substances to help in digesting food, but food does not pass through these organs. So what do I mean by digestive glands? The organs that help in digestion, but food doesn't pass through them. We're going to talk about three main glands in the digestive system. The first glands are called the salivary glands. Okay, so these are the salivary glands. They secrete saliva that will help in the digestion of food, but the food will not touch, will not pass through the salivary glands. And then the second gland is the pancreas. This pancreas that look like a leaf. Also the pancreas will secrete something to help in the digestion of food, but the food will not pass inside the pancreas. Look, this is a part of the small intestine. The food will keep on passing inside the small intestine, but it will not go inside the pancreas. And finally, the last gland we're gonna talk about for now is the liver, okay? So this huge organ in our body, it's called the liver. It also helps in the digestion of food, mainly fats, but the food will not pass inside. So, as a summary, and this is what you have to write on your notebook. This is what you're going to study. So, the digestive system in humans is made up of two main parts the digestive tube and the digestive glands. What are the different organs of the digestive tube? The mouth, the esophagus, the stomach, the small intestine, the large intestine, and the anus. However, the digestive glands are made up of organs, <coughs> sorry, and these organs will help in digestion, but food will not pass inside, the digestive glands that you're responsible for are the salivary glands, the pancreas, and the liver. Okay, so this is the main point of the whole, uh, of the whole activity. The digestive system is made up of two parts, tube and glands. Tube are mouth, esophagus, stomach, small intestine, large intestine, and anus. 
and the glands where food doesn't pass, salivary glands, pancreas, and liver. Finally, now I want to make sure that you understood everything in this part. So I'm going to ask you to label the digestive system. Label means annotate. So you're going to say the name. What's one? What's two till number ten? Okay? Thank you.